Hello people, welcome to the weekly update here from Barrett Collector, this is Barrett and it is that time of the month. Today we're going to take a look at the main Sword and Shield booster boxes and as always what we like to do here on a monthly basis we take a look at the number of boxes available both on TCG Player and on Car Market so we cover both the European and the American market. So before we get started I'll just tell you 20 seconds I just want to thank everyone for the life break that happened yesterday, Saturday, where we finally had, I believe it is, based on my research, it's the first live box break that we had in Europe that was not made in a European language, but it was actually made in English, apart from obviously um, native English speakers. So I'm thinking about Ireland, I'm thinking about the UK. So pretty happy about that, had a ton of fun, hope you guys had too. And uh, as I said, hopefully this will be the first of many. That being said, don't forget to check out the Discord if you want to stay updated to any other up box breaks coming in the channel, as well as if you want to join a growing community of both European and Americans talking about Pokemon. So, that being said, today I'll try to not steal too much of your time and simply we'll take a look at the number of boxes. Again, I know these are not all the boxes that are available in the market. Again, we're only taking a look at TCG player and car market as well as people might want to sell later on in the future. However, current market condition on TCG player and car market, these are the boxes that are available. We track them here on a monthly basis and we record everything on a spreadsheet, which we're going to take a look at in just a second. So, so we'll get started with Chilling Rain. As you can see, lowest listed on car market is at 150 euros. However, the seller does have zero feedbacks. And then we start from 160. There's some slightly damage, as you can see here, 162. This one says not for display, so potentially not in mint condition. It looks like we are starting to get for a minty copy, 166, 168. Now, if you're familiar with the channel or with car market, you know this presses do not include shipping. So if you're not familiar, this is not shipped. You got that shipping. And depending on the European country you live in, it can be up to 20, 25 even for a box at the lowest usually goes for around 10 euros for shipping depends on the seller usually if it's a professional seller they'll have a cheaper shipping than a regular private individual so that's car market if we take a look at chilling rain on tcg player you can see how it is selling 475 dollars you can see you're selling on a daily basis and already if you can scroll this is the last page you see already crazy prices which maybe a few years down the line this could be possible and same goes for car market you can see here lowest lower bottom on the listing you can see how prices obviously are much more expensive so, so straight into spreadsheet as you can see chill and rain we have available right now 53 booster boxes on tcg player 104 car market and then we have 12 cases on tcg player and 16 cases on car market now for reference the cases on tcg player the lowest listed goes for 1.1 shipped and the highest for 3k obviously the more you get towards the higher end so 3k the more they are expensive so again you can get them for as cheap as 1.1 whereas on the european market car market the lowest goes for 1.5 thousand euros and then the highest goes for 4k same thing the closer you get for 4k the more the price is going to be expensive as one of my viewers suggested last time, I charted the number of boxes available, both on car market and TG player, so you can have a visual representation of how the market is moving. Simply, orange car market, blue TG player, you can see how we did have an increase number of boxes available on the European market. We, If you don't remember here, or if you weren't there, we had a seller dumping a ton of boxes here, which is why this number exponentially increased and now it looks like either the seller has taken those back or else they have started to sell whereas a tissue player you can see a steady decline in the number of boxes available so that being said moving on to the next one which is fusion strike fusion strike as you can see low stays 150 again zero feedbacks and then this one is from the uk so if you're buying from the eu you're gonna have to pay customs so you can see you can get it for as cheap as 160 not perfect so i would say mint condition around 165 to 170 euros same thing goes for 
the listings here on the lower end of the page, you're going to pay crazy prices, which again, it's on market price right now, but could it be in one, two, three years? Who knows? We're going to find out. Fusion Strike, $170 for a box. Market price, you can see here, they are selling regularly on a daily basis, and you can see they are they are listed for as cheap as $185, $200. And uh, one thing that is worth mentioning is that both Fusion Strike and Chilling Rain have not sold out on the UK Pokemon Center. Now, if you're not familiar, yes, the United Kingdom is in Europe. However, it is not in the European Union. So if you are in Europe, you need to pay customs and also you cannot buy directly from the Pokemon Center if you are in the European Union. But for reference, it is still available at £143 in the UK, which I think is a, it should be more than $160. It should be around 160, 170 euros. So it should be, it could be a, about uh, $180, not sure right now. Anyways, just wanted to inform you guys, it is not sold out in the UK. Now, Fusion Strike, let's do the same thing. Let's look at the number of boxes available. So here, as you can see, Fusion Strike, 63 boxes available on TCG Player, 85 car market, six cases on TCG Player, and 17 on car market. Now, again, for reference, the cases on TCG Player, lowest 1.2, highest 1.8, and then on car market, lowest 1,025 euros, and then the highest 4K. Again, same thing. The more you get towards the higher hand prices, so 4K in the U, uh, in the EU and 1.8 in the US, the more you're gonna get closer to the price. So lowest you can get 1.2 in the US, 1.25. So, sorry, 1.025. So 1,025 euros in the European Union. Let's look at the chart. So let's see how it is evolving. We only have three data points. As you can see, starting from November 25th all the way to today and um, again orange current market tcg player in blue as you can see it's a common factor that they are both moving lower they've been moving lower currently more in the eu than in the us however what is i think more most important is to see that they're both going down in supply now moving on to the next one which should be brilliant stars so again, Brilliant Star, so to be honest, this guy here, this seller here has a few listings available for crazily cheap and zero references, and it is um, directing you to their shop. So yeah, not gonna comment on that. Anyways, lowest listed 164 if we exclude this seller. So 165 to 170 is where you can get, you can get a minty copy, so I would say more, 170 then 165 and then as always the lower you go here on the page the more expensive it's going to get simply so tcg player as you can see here it is selling for 165 i guess you could say 165 this is the last page of listing so obviously it's pretty much logic it's they're ordered by selling price yeah it is selling regularly for what 165 i believe these do not include shipping so nothing unusual there and if we take a look at the number of boxes available for brilliant stars we can see how we have 59 on tg player 168 on car market 12 cases on, on tg player 16 on car market and again for reference lowest listed case on tg player is at 979 dollars highest 2.2,000 even, sorry. And then on car market, the lowest listed goes for 1,150 euros and the highest for 4,000. Again, taking a look at the number of boxes, how they are evolving in time, we can see how they're moving. It looks like they're moving in the same direction. Now there are more boxes available on car market than a TG player. However, they're pretty much steady if we take a look at the European market, 198 back in November, 168 now, whereas they kind of um, halved on the American market over the past, what, four months. So pretty interesting. And uh, again, without further ado, we're on to the next one, which 
is Astral Radiance. Now, I'm a big fan of Astral, mainly because I grew up with Diamond and Pearl, so I'm a big fan of Palk and Dialga. And I did say how the Palk and Dialga here, the alt art, they're, what, going for 30 35 dollars euros 40 m max so cheap in my opinion but that's my humble opinion and that's i mean that's how the market it is pricing them so again this seller does not ship to me and again if you're new to the channel i'm in italy so not sure why anyways lowest listed 120 um, now for reference astral has been the only box that is cheaper on the european market than in the American, you can see $130 plus shipping. And if we take a look at the lowest listings to go on the first page, we can see how lowest listed, uh, what, zero reference, so no zero feedbacks, not good. 145 shipped. So it is cheaper in the U than the US. That's the only box on the sold and shoe block that is that has this type of trend. Anyways, looking at the number of people on the market, we have 109 boxes on TG Player, 283 on Car Market, 11 cases on TG Player, 8 cases on Car Market, and again, lowest listed on TCG is $858, highest 1.2, and then on Car Market in the European Union, lowest listed is at $748, is at 748 euros, whereas again, once again, the highest listed goes for 4,000 euros. Take a look at the number of boxes dynamically. We can see how they haven't really moved much. A bit less available on car market and a bit more available on uh, Digi Player, but pretty much they're pretty much steady over the past four months, which kind of tells me that supply is equal to demand, which is why prices haven't really moved. And uh, that makes sense in theory. If supply is equal to demand, price is going to be stable. So microeconomics 101, it works. So pretty much interesting astral. I wonder, and that's a question for you guys as well, as well as my own opinion, will people, forgive me the word, wake up? So will people wake up and realize that astral is not that bad actually, and um, they're going to start to buy? And if, again, if demand overcomes supply, that's when price start to move higher now moving on to the two newer addition to the list which are lost origin and sold and ship base let's take a look at lost origin here on car market lowest listed goes for 129 and then we have a bunch of them at uh, slightly above 133 euros dcg player lowest listed goes for 160 which it's pretty interesting and uh, again it, they are selling for 160 so quite the move to the upside as you can see here over the past four months on the american market and if we take a look at the number of boxes available we have 82 on tcg player 334 in car market nine cases on tcg 30 kids car market and again for reference lowest listed on tcg 1k highest 1.8 and then on car market lowest listed goes for 769 euros and there are actually 11 cases at that price which quite remarkable and then highest goes for 4000 so we do not have a chart for lost origin as it is a new addition to the monthly update and then last but not least i wanted to add sword and shield base just to give you an example of a certain point how much supply and demand is more important than what's inside the box as you can see as you probably know, the cards inside Sword and Shield Base are pretty much worth nothing. Um, I think the what, most expensive card is, what, 10 euros, $10? So they're pretty much worth nothing compared to, let's say, the chase card from all of these sets. The Tina, the Charizard, the Mew, the Gengar, so on and so forth, the Bazinkan, so on and so forth. You get the idea. So... Do people want to open it to go after the chase card? I doubt it. However, yes, they weren't printed as heavily as all these guys here. But the number of bucks available is so low that price must be so high. As you can see here, 
285 lowest listed on car market and then 265 dollars lowest listed on tcg player so this is pretty pricey people are not really interested in opening it because there's really no chase card and uh, the fact there's just so few of these boxes out there is just drives the price to south of $300 and as you can see it does sell we have February 28th a recorded sale on TCG player and then March 1st another one so it sells doesn't sell daily because I mean there's just not as many boxes and I also believe there's just not as much demand however it does sell so just wanted to put it out there hope you guys appreciate the monthly update on on these sword and shield boxes as always let me know down in the comments if you enjoy this type of content and if you want more hope to see you all in the discord and thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one